Hey guys, Ronc23 here from Centerfuge Gaming, and uh, we're gonna play some Drill Dozer. Yeah, so uh, this is a game released for the Game Boy Advanced in 1776. Christopher Columbus actually discovered it in the New World, and uh, it uh, looks like a pretty swell game. So I've only played a little of the first level, and then uh, just to get myself acquainted with the controls. And I'm actually using a, a real controller controller for this. So uh, yeah, this is the real deal. Just because of the the L and R mechanic. Looks like later in the game I'm going to need to use both L and R, which uh, you really need a controller for that. So uh, let's get started. Alright, so we open onto a street. We got a truck. I don't need to narrate what's happening, but I'm doing it anyway, just because I don't know what else to say in this cutscene. Looks like we're here! The red diamond those evil skulkers stole from us has to be in this hideout! They're probably waiting for you, so watch yourself in there! So I guess we're that cute little pink-haired girl with the, uh, um, the Pokemon-like bodysuit there. Gitmo and I will be supporting you from back here at the trailer! Call us with your drill doses comm system if you get into trouble! <laughs> don't sweat it, Grutch. She can take care of herself. Okay, so we've got uh, Gearmo and Grutch. I'll never remember those names. Alright, looks like we're drilling into the facility here. Looks like some Ninja 5 bank uh, stuff. I am so ready for this. And obviously, since I said I played the first level of it, I know exactly what's going to happen here. Fall into a hole. <laughs> I love that extra scene of her falling there. Really uh, adds to the game story. This game, it looks like it does have a little more story than, uh, Ninja 5 -0, which is good. Are you okay, boss? Oh, jeez, that's not, that's not pleasant. Man, we haven't even played and we're dead. Oh, okay. You must have sprung a skulker trap and fallen into a pit! Is your drill dozer still in one piece? Um, I'm not. <laughs> Boss! Can you hear me, boss? You're still inside your drill dozer, aren't you? What? You're not! We got a silent protagonist here. We've come to get you- we've gotta get you back to your dozer! <laughs> you can still hear me, right? That means it has to be close by. Ah, back into it! Oh, hey, there it is. Oh, what? Okay, looks like our dozer has some sentience. Oh, and I'm still... It takes a lot more than a nasty fall to take a drill dozer out of commission. Just listen to that engine purr. I built it myself. I tightened every screw and greased every gear. It won't let you down. But you're gonna have to find a way back to the surface. I can fix you back up at the trailer. Just do whatever it takes to get out of there. You're a tough boss! Show what you got! Your drill dozer is still working, so you should be able to get out of there! Why don't you stoop around a little? Alright, so we're in the game. Let's see, we can jump. That's kind of a nice nifty jump. You can see the little, uh... I guess the drill dozer has a rocket on the back. And, um, okay, so... We can jump. What does B do? B... We... We get out. Okay, so we're looking around. That's kind of like the, uh... uh Ninja 5 -0, that that, uh, button I pressed, like, twice. <laughs> and, obviously... Well, let's let the game tell us here. So we can press R or L to spin my drill. And we can hold R or L to rev up the drill and max out your power gauge. Gauge, gauge, I always don't know. Okay, so they want us to max out our power gauge. You can even drill stuff above and below you! Now get out there and try it! Okay, so... We can definitely drill. Okay, so... We're only level 1 drill right now, but yeah, that's kind of awesome. We can just drill through any wall, basically. Whoa there, boss! You feel a little dizzy? You're probably still a little woozy from that fall! You'll be alright! Your drill dozer can shred through these walls like wet paper! Ah, I wouldn't go that far. Go wild and drill right through this wall in front of you! Alright, let's go wild. 
Okay, but we can't really just like drill directly through the wall. We kind of have to stop, drill, walk. Although I think you can drill while walking. Yeah, it just takes a little time to break the wall, which is messing that up. Okay, so awesome. We just destroyed those entire walls and the pieces. And okay, we got a boss You're inside the skulker hideout. Wow, that was easy. Keep on busting through their base, but watch out for traps. Wow, so their traps just lead you directly to their hideout. That's uh, that's very useful for people like me. Oh, and what's this? Okay, looks like money or something. I really don't know what that is. So. <laughs> All right. Oh my God, we got bad electrical wiring. This is worse than the airport. Oh, we got another com here. Hey, Jill. Okay, so we're Jill. Did <laughs> did they say that ever before? Let me tell you really quick about that self-repairing barrier up ahead. The Skulkers keep their hideout heavily guarded. Self-repairing barriers? What are you babbling about? Oh, we got some crazy characters here. I'm saying this thing can repair itself even when it's being drilled. You're gonna have to upgrade your drill dozer's gears to drill through it. Luckily for you, there's a gearbox nearby. Look around for a bright red box. Oh, glad the Skulkers left some boxes with drills in them. I'm glad that our team is so unprepared that they sent their boss into the main hideout we're trying to recover something from with the least powerful drill. But, uh, hey. Skulkers, they got us covered. And looks like we got the second gear, or whatever the hell that means. Okay, looks like we can store three gears up there, so... Oh! Hey, are you paying attention? Oh, and I'm now cold again. Alright, so shifting up to another gear has a lot of power to your drill! When your drill is spinning, press R at just the right time to SHIFT! Okay, so... Then we press R, and we shift to a better drill. Alright. Basic game mechanics here. I assume we'll be getting a lot more levels up in the future, or at least to level 3. So, Okay, so we press the R button, we press the R button, and then we shift up to level 2. Got it. Okay, and then level 2 lasts a lot longer. Nice. What is that thing in the background? <laughs> Learning to shift up is important! That's why you had some kind of psychotic dream! <laughs> it's easily your most powerful weapon! Don't worry if you're not great at it now! You'll get better as you go along! If you forget how to do anything, press SELECT! And then press the L button to read the help file. Thanks for breaking the fourth wall there. I thought only my dreams were supposed to do that. Okay, so we press SELECT. Okay, and we can look at all our drill types and we can press HELP. And it gives us uh, information on stuff we haven't even learned how to do yet. Nice! Okay. And we're in Tunnel 2! Yeah, apparently the... <laughs> something I read on Wikipedia that the um, American translators for this game had to name every uh, passageway, which is kind of hilarious. Okay, so we can break that barrier with our level 2 drill. Awesome. Nice work. You drove right through that barrier. <laughs> Your new gear will have you destroying stuff even faster than usual. You should keep your drill spraying even when you're moving around! That way, you can protect yourself from incoming bullets! I think Hat Guy's voice is channeling a little of that one guy from Giron Lagon in a way. Okay, and I'm not gonna make any... however it's pronounced, jokes, because this game did come out beforehand, and it doesn't deserve that type of punishment. <laughs> I mean, who the hell do you think I am? Oh, hey, we can look at this. The young girl with the drill dozer has broken into our hideout. Don't let her anywhere near the factory on the surface. Wow. <laughs> okay, looks like we need to get up to the factory in the sur- Oh, oh. Okay, we got uh, some helpful friends here. Some to beat us in. And, uh, okay, so all we have to do is drill into them, and they're incredibly easy to beat. Nice. I love those really easy to beat enemies. Oh! One of them. Wow. <laughs> okay, so we killed those random guys. I guess those were the skulkers. Not as impressive as I expected, but they are the first enemy we encounter, so they're obviously not top tier uh, gang members here. All right, so we can we can drill in midair, and I know we can drill up and stuff too. So a lot of uses for the drill. Okay, so we can go down here, and then we can also come up here. Let's just come up here. Really okay, so we can go through here. Yeah, you gotta look for the, uh, the walls with the cracks in them, because those are definitely the drillable ones. I mean, anyone playing the game would discover that in two seconds, but just for all the people out there who are looking for a walkthrough on this first level because they didn't realize a crack was in the wall, there you go. Yeah, you can stop watching the video. 
Alright, so we've eliminated half our viewership, and uh, you guys who stuck with me, I'm proud of you. So it looks like we're missing a, uh, <laughs> missing a screw there, that's not good. Giant screw. And we gotta drill through that door, obviously. Uh, looks like this guy's still trying to use the uh, laundry room here, whatever. Are those pictures of girls up on the walls? Skulkers! For shame! Come on, man. They do have some nice uh, outfits there, so... Dog! Quit your barking. Yeah, we got some uh, happy bass players in the background here. I'm right by a main road, it's the best place to do a uh, let's play. <laughs> oh, we also have to drill this out because we need stairs. Glad to know our uh, drill dozer can not even jump that high. Even though we probably should have equipped it with some better rockets, but hey, it's a heavy thing. Okay, so... Alright, we need to read this. Okay, sorry guys, uh, there's like a shift in the video there and stuff, like, all the crap went down during the pause. Okay, so, <laughs> reading this dialogue box. There are all kinds of crazy lifts in this factory! See that one above you? It's called a socket lift. Drill into the socket. You'll latch onto it as long as you spin your drill. Alright, so it looks like the, that thing having a seizure trying to get past this block, and uh, glad the skulkers uh, block off their own lifts. It's always useful. You know, they obviously have uh, powerful drills like I do, so... Alright, so we just have to uh, use our power of level 2 to drill long enough to use that lift. That's kind of a cool mechanic. And now we're breaking through this wall, and we can enter this passageway. Alright, so... We got some new enemies here. Alright. Or wait, are these new? I think we fought them in the, uh, the passage before, but... Anyway, they're incredibly easy to beat, because... All the enemies, you just walk up to them and drill. <laughs> Not too difficult. Alright, so... We're heading over here. We got another power-up or whatnot there, so let's head over and get that. And let's see, what do we got? Oh! Some... I don't know what those would be. Some. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's money, because it looks like something you would collect to pay. And there's different uh, sizes of it, so that is obviously money. And let's head up here. Now we got another door we can go into, so let's go into. And then we come out in here. Oh, oh, we got a bullet man. Okay. So, alright, all we gotta do is get past his bullets by using the drill. Take him out, get our money. And I guess we have to get up there from a different way. So for now let's just head back down. I hope the enemies don't respawn, even though I Yeah they do, dang. So we took out that bullet guy for nothing. Well maybe we can uh get some more money. <laughs> I guess that's one good thing. You can farm enemies, you know, for all your- Oh! Looks like this uh, isn't the place we want to go to here. Yep. Dang. Oh. This looks like the exit, but they blocked it off. You'll need a third gear to drill through that barrier like butter! Alright, so we need to find our third gear. Alright. Well, there's a lot of passageways we haven't been, so let's head through here first. Go through this wall. Is, it, is this taking us down to where we could have drilled from back there? I'm not sure. Oh, can we not get through there? Uh, okay, well then why'd you have us drill through there? Maybe there's a power up or something. Okay, so. Let's, oops, let's just do this. Oh, I like the ducking thing. She just ducks into the, the drill. That's kind of awesome. Alright. Drill through there. Go down here. Kill everything. I like the signs on the walls, the shapes. If you ever need a circle, a triangle, and a square, go through this door. Okay, so we got uh, some security cameras. It's like a uh, speaker up there, but we can't... Oh, there's a... But we definitely want to drill through these boxes. So we can get nothing. Unless that's supposed to be it. Nope. Okay. So let's drill through the obvious crack wall over here. And we got another one of these crazy lifts. You know those skulkers. They're pretty ingenious when they, uh, they have their moments, you know. Alright, I'm pretty sure I don't want to drill those. Any I've learned from Wanderlust that, uh, big red barrels, something you don't uh, want to mess with. So I guess let's just go over here and then, yeah, just climb up here. Looks like we can get through this wall. I love the drilling in midair, that's, that's a really awesome. Well, I must be picking up some kind of coinage, or that's probably just some little items in there. 
<laughs> uh, or they just have some random drillable holes in the wall that no one would ever want to drill. You know, they're trying to keep the realism. Not every cracked wall leads to another passage, and that, that really makes sense. Okay, so let's get through here. And it looks like we found our third gear, if I'm... The uh, symbolism is correct. Yes, we do. Awesome. And we got the third gear. Wow, and we are both incredibly happy there. Oh, we got a call. Whoa, you just found the third gear. You've got to try that thing out. Hold down R when you hit the highest gear to keep the drill spinning. You know, really? At third gear, you'll be boring through blocks like butter. I think they've used like butter three times now. Bust down everything in sight and show them you mean business. Alright, wow, our gears are just pulsating like crazy up there. Alright, awesome. So we can shift up three times for maximum drilling power. Wow, we are busting through things like butter. Look how long, look how slow it is to decrease. We can just drill forever here. This is amazing. <laughs> that is awesome. Okay. Well, now we can definitely break that barrier in the other room, I'll tell you that. Or in this room. Oh! Unnecessary. We have drill three. We're basically a god by now. You plebeians and your <laughs> barriers. Keep your drill spinning to deflect incoming fire! I already learned that, old man. Just don't drill into missiles or bombs, or you'll be sorry! Oh, I wonder what would happen if I did that. Now, it's always nice to experiment. Okay, so let's uh, cream through all the enemies here. Why do we even need to... <laughs> Why does he even need to say that? We have drill three. We can just keep drilling forever and ever. Alright, so let's obviously drill down here. Man, I do love being a god here. Alright, so let's power up to drill 3 and then get going. And those guys have quite a bit of health. Okay, and if we... If we, uh... You should die. If we jump, it cancels our drill, so don't jump. Okay. That looks like we got a little... Coinage there, and then let's, uh... Head down. I love when the, you upgrade, she does the hi -ha! That's pretty cool. Jill, pretty cool character. Okay, can we not get uh, hit from both sides? That worked in Ninja 5 when we got Ninja Stars, but not in this game where we can only drill one direction at a time. Okay, so... Ooh, what's that? What's that? Oh, that's health. Okay. Where are we right now? <laughs> uh, nothing looks like it's impenetrable. Okay. Uh, does that mean we should go down here? Yes? No? Maybe so? Let's do it anyway, because at least there'll be some kind of power-up or something down there. Or they might try to be realistic -y. Oh, this is back here. Okay, well, let's not fight that guy again. And any coin farming we could have done, we've uh, avoided. Let's take out this guy. And head over here. Yeah, I think it was right over here. Yep, there it is. Let's power up. Oh yeah, that's pretty amazing. Alright, and there's the exit, I think. Or at least the entrance to the next area. Ooh, an elevator. Alright, we're heading up to the third of... Oh, second. Oh, no. The third of three floors. Those are some huge floors. Alright, looks like we've ended up in the... Bank again? The airport? Harbor? Base? Last level? Oh, okay, we can go through here. Look out! There's a tank up ahead! A tank?! Try drilling into it, the hole on its nose. Whoa! Okay. Looks like we got a boss fight here. Alright, so they said don't try drilling into missiles, so we're just gonna jump over them. And now we're gonna drill right into the nose. Oh man! That just looked painful! That looks really painful. Okay, so, simple boss fight here. All we have to do is wait till it stops shooting missiles. And, okay. We need to drill into its nose before it closes its nose, so yeah, like that. We only have to do that twice, it looks like. <laughs> that was incredibly easy. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh man, we don't get those. Okay. Awesome. Great, okay. So we defeated that incredibly easily. Let's head on. Don't forget that you can drill the other direction, boss! Press the opposite button to rotate your drill the other way! The opposite of R is L, and the opposite of L is R. Seriously, dude? 
Hey, we're not two-year-olds, and if two-year-olds play this game, well, I probably shouldn't be giving you that voice. I don't have to draw a pi draw you a picture, do I? <laughs> no, you don't. Okay, we got it. We're the boss. We're the leader of the team. At least that's what I thought. Okay, so we press B and exit. Okay. Okay, so we can enter here. We can try turning it every which way. All right, looks like they want us to turn it in the R direction here. So let's do just that. I think. Wow, so three lasts forever, I guess. It never decreases. Oh, what did that do? What am I s Maybe I'm supposed to go this way? Anyone? Uh, I just want to get through here. Just trying to, uh... Oh, wait, this... Well, what? What do they want us to do? It doesn't... Oh, duh! It's making the, uh... Sorry, that was in the background, I didn't notice. It's making the garage look dumb. Okay, well, we, we left it up. And now we can head through. Awesome. Alright, we're now outside. Looks like this wall's drillable. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got another one. Alright, let's close the, close the garage door. It's only, uh... It's only fair to the skulkers. We don't want to just leave the open air. They could get bats in their garage or something. Or some cattle decide to hang out in the top and get crushed. Or, you know... Okay, yeah, that happened to my cat. Anyway, looks like we made it out. Oh man, that was an ordeal. You made it. Uh, <laughs> you made it back. Well, right hold on. I couldn't pick you up. So, why did we go in there again? <laughs> well, nevertheless, we got picked up and we beat the first level where we were trying to do something, but uh. Guess we got sidetracked and then quit? <laughs> Area cleared. Woo! And we're being lowered back in. <laughs> nice to see you guys in person again. I was getting tired of hearing your voices. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What's happening to the, another... What's happening to the drill dozer there? Oh my god. Shouldn't have worked that thing so hard, man. Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. Whoa, your drill dozer really took a beating. Your drill dozer's gears won't last forever, you know. They'll come out after every eight levels, so you'll be forced to collect them again. They get worn away over time from hard use. Don't sweat it, though. I'll patch her up as best as I can. Well, thank you, Mr. Hat. Oh, and, uh, patched up. Nice. Did we get the gears back? Oh, we're back down to just one gear. Well, what do you know? Other than that, your drill dozer should be just like new, cutie. Oh, I knew picking that voice. Guillermo, you can't disrespect your boss like that. You know those skulker thugs roughed up her dad, Doug. Uh, oh, her dad, Doug. <laughs> and we get a picture of Doug. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> so Joe is taking over as the boss of the Red Dozers while he's recovering. Gosh, you both know this very well. I'm just a uh, randomly expositing here. She's the boss now. You can't call her cutie. Nobody calls the boss cutie! Alright, alright, it's just a nickname, sheesh. So, you managed to escape from that trap, but this time... We're taking back the red diamond they stole from us. Sounds like a plan to me, man. Do I want to save? I do. I won't remove the game pack. I'm tempted, but I won't. Oh, jeez, that is a weird picture of Jill there, man. Okay, so... Uh, what is this? Okay, we have a map. Oh, we can choose a mission area. Equipment. Um, check out our treasures and save our progress. Alright, well, let's look at our equipment here. Okay, so this is just that screen where we can see what our equipment's like. We can't actually select any of this, so... We can look at the help menu and stuff. Okay, so... Looks like we will be getting some drill bit and uh, drill type uh, changes, which is pretty cool, I think, so... And we have 173 chips. Those are chips. Okay, so. Oops, I accidentally to stay there. Alright, let's back out. Um, let's take a look at our treasures while we. Okay, so we don't have any treasures collected yet. And we can't even scroll down. Looks like there's 31 treasures, so. I we'll, guess we'll be trying to get those. Okay, yeah, we haven't found any of these treasures yet. Got it. And save our progress, we just did, so let's head out. 
Alright, so Area 1, Skulker Factory. Red Dozer's training. Oh, okay, that was the... So it looks like we should head to the Skulker Factory next. And, uh, I think that'll be next time on, uh, let's play Drill Dozer. This is Ron C23, Centrifuge Gaming, and, uh, I'll see you guys when we take on the factory.